Hey guys, Joey, First String Lawn Care here. So, uh, I'm gonna see if this video will play. Uh, I don't know if I have enough storage on the phone. Uh, I'm getting new phones tomorrow. We're gonna upgrade. We're gonna get some uh, better video out here, guys. Hopefully this one will, will uh, get us through here for today. All right. Some of y'all have asked about this trailer and uh, putting on or attaching all of our short can stuff, all this green touch <clears throat> stuff that we have here. How do you put it on these round tube trailers? All right, guys, make this very simple. So these tubes are round. It comes with these plates right here. All right, you have, and it only has one. Uh, and it comes with all the bolts. Now you may, now these barely made it through, the ones that go up from the bottom into the, the top here, they barely made it. So I would suggest, you know, maybe getting a little bit longer screw, but I mean, these things, I mean, they're, they're, they're on there. And I, I, I may have come out here one time and tighten these things up, but <clears throat> they, they're, they're really solid. And that's one thing I was wondering about uh, with these uh, green touch racks and attaching something to my trailer with all the vibration. I was wondering, you know, how are they really going to hold up? But man, they do, they hold up. They're, they're well worth the money. So here's one that I bought longer bolts for. So guys, just the, the trick with these round tube trailers and kind of with anything, you just got to make sure that you're uh, straight up down vertical and then you need to be in the center, you know, up here, you know, whenever you're, when you're measuring out your holes, you need to be in the center here. And then when you're drilling your holes, just make sure that you're straight up and down because that's how you're going to get up. You're going to, that's the only way you're going to get them off. Uh, but yeah, it just has guys. It just has one plate on the front and you're going to drill a hole from, uh, the center here through the back. Uh, see if I can get a, so here's the, the back. Do you see it doesn't even have one on this side and it only comes with two, I think, uh, and it, it, I only needed one. Now it may come with two, but you see, you know, you've got this bolt right here. It's going to be in the way, so it doesn't matter. I, I think you only put one on one side. <clears throat> now, how solid is it? I mean, it's not even moving, you know, and they're all the same. See, like these, I bought longer screws for those. So that's just two, that's just two, that's just two. And these just, these don't even, uh, the gas, nothing but the weed eater rack has the, uh, the mount, the, the mounting bracket, because that's all you need it for. You don't need it for any of the other stuff. So, <clears throat> you know, you just have to make sure you got everything even whenever you're doing this. And that's it, guys. Get everything even, measure twice, drill once, you know. But, man, everything's working out good for us on this trailer. I love it. All right, guys, hope I helped out. If any of y'all uh, looking to get these uh, green touch ladder racks, uh, <clears throat> green touch blower racks, green touch gas can holders sprayers man uh this stuff is awesome it saves you a ton a ton of time in the field i can't tell you how much time it saves you know but guys it's joey from first string lawn care i'm out here we got work to do